What's up guys, stick to your guns here. I just want to do a video really quick to tell you Arc Fear Evolved 4 is coming very soon. Um, that way you're prepared for it. And this is what it is. It is an event going from October 22nd through November 6th. And there's going to be two times breeding, two times player XP. Uh, so if you want to raise some dinos, this is going to be the time to do it. I plan on getting my gigas done finally during this. Um, there's some other things that are going to be coming too. Looks like 11 new themed uh, chibis and 7 new dinosaur skins. The chibis are skeletal. These are all skeletal basically. But there's the giga, the quetzal, the jerboa, the bronto, the stego, the trike, the raptor, the rex, the carno the bone wyvern and the zombie wyvern so that's cool and it looks like you kill dodo wyverns dodo rex or you can make them in the cooking pot so that's pretty interesting ghost creature skins you can read those that's cool uh, apparently there's going to be ghost creatures you kill them and then you can acquire these skins I'm not exactly sure what those will be but that sounds cool um, there's some items you can get pumpkins stolen headstones scarecrow yada yada emotes There's two brand new emotes. That's kind of cool scare emote a knock emote And then there's a few emotes coming back zombie dance panic Skins for the crock pot cooking pot. You can make a reaper swimsuit jack-o-lantern swimsuit That's cool now the other cool thing about this event is it's bringing back a bunch of colored dinos dark gray light blue dark yellow light brown yada yada whatever there's new colors though vermilion that is a shade of red between scarlet and red not quite scarlet i don't know i think that's the best i can explain it some type of red um black actual black hopefully that's like solid black dinos that'll be pretty cool midnight blue medium autumn dark warm gray orange dark lavender that's cool it's a new color and then jade um let's see what else oh the uh the live tuning system here you go if you want to read about that the thing that really interested me on this community crunch is the structure stasis changes so if you're familiar with the game atlas the way that it works is it's a giant map split up into a grid of little squares and each one of those squares is actually its um, own individual server and as you travel around the map you're actually moving between servers and that's how they split up the, the player base and handle the load so it's not um, overloading one server and now from what i understand it seems like a system similar to that is coming to arc but on like a smaller scale where the structures, it says right here, the structures are now broken up into a grid. When a player logs in, they are assigned grid cells appropriate to their location. And the structures in those cells are loaded. That way, not all are loaded. That sounds like the way Atlas works. And um, I'm hopeful. I think that sounds really good. I mean, if that helps with like the rubber banding because you're not having to load in such a large area and the overall lag for ARC, I, that's great. So I'm very interested to see how that plays out. But yeah, so um, it looks like we got a fun little Halloween event coming up. The fourth Fear Evolved event between October 22nd and November 6th. Get your babies ready to raise. Get your character ready to gain two times XP. Stick to your guns. Tuning out.